Hey everyone, in this video, we will see how you can add a logon banner using group policy. Typically, a logon banner is supposed to contain information regarding what is considered appropriate use of the system, and mention that the system is under supervision for detecting unauthorized and illegal activity, and privacy cannot be expected while using the system. These are most often used in organizations for legal reasons. These interactive logon messages can be configured using GPOs in Active Directory. Let's see how you can do it. Go to Server Manager, then click on Tools, and select Group Policy Management. In the left pane here, navigate to the domain on which you want the policy to be applied. Right-click on the domain container and click Create a GPO in this domain and link it here. Enter a name for the GPO and click OK. Back in the Group Policy Management window now, right-click on the GPO that was just created and click Edit. In the Group Policy Management Editor window that pops up, navigate to Computer Configuration, Policies, Windows Settings, security settings, local policies, and finally, security options. On the right pane of the console, select the interactive logon, message text for users attempting to log on policy. This is used to specify the text message to be displayed to the users at the time of logon. In the security policy settings tab, check the define this policy settings in the template checkbox. Enter the logon message to be displayed, and then click apply and OK. Next, select the interactive logon, message title for users attempting to log in policy. This is used to specify the title that appears on the title bar of the interactive logon window. In the security policy settings tab, check the define this policy settings in the template checkbox. Enter an appropriate title, and then click apply and OK. After configuring the title, you can force update the group policy for it to take effect immediately. And done. The user now can log in by clicking on the OK button on the warning message that will be displayed. To know a little more about this process, check out our article in the description right below the like button. And also make sure to subscribe for more such videos. So that's it for today's video, and I'll see you in the next one.